Okay, we're going to apply what we've been working on with multiplying and dividing fractions. In the chemistry lab, there's a bottle with two liters of a 15% solution of hydrogen peroxide, H2O2. John removes one-fifth of what is in the bottle, and he puts it in a beaker. Then he measures the amount of H2O2 in the beaker, and adds twice that amount of water to the beaker. We need to find the amount of H2O2 left in the bottle, and then the amount of diluted H2O2 in the beaker, and then find the concentration of H2O2 in the beaker. So let's start with uh, problem A here, the amount of H2O2 left in the bottle. If he started with two liters of the entire solution, and he took out one-fifth of what was there, then he took out one-fifth of a liter per liter, so one-fifth times two, or a total of two-fifths of a liter that he removed. If he removed two-fifths of a liter, we started with two full liters, we're going to subtract two-fifths of a liter, I'm going to convert the two-fifths into tenths, because it'll be easier to convert it to a decimal. Two-fifths is the same thing as four-tenths, so that means that this problem is the same as saying two minus point four, or four-tenths, 2 minus 0.4 is 1.6. So there's 1.6 liters left in the bottle. Now the amount of diluted H2O2 in the beaker, he said that he took out 2 fifths of a liter, which we calculated just a minute ago, and we put that in the beaker. So we had 2 fifths in there already. And then it says that he measured the amount of H2O2 and added twice that amount of water to the beaker. So we have two-fifths of a liter of the solution plus four-fifths of a liter of water. That gives us six-fifths of solution in the beaker. Six-fifths of a liter would be the same as twelve-tenths, which would be 1.2 liters. Now to figure the calculation of H2O in the beaker, we know that we started with two-fifths of a liter of a 15% solution. That means that the amount of pure H2O in that solution is 15% of that two liters. So we'd have 0.15 times 40%, I'm sorry, times uh, two-fifths of a liter, which would be four-tenths of a liter, We'll convert that to a decimal also, so 0.15 times 0.4, that gives us 0 0.06 liters. After he adds the water, there's going to be 1.2 liters of solution in the beaker, so if 0 0.06 liters is the amount that's actually pure water, then we're going to have 0 0.06 out of 1.2 liters that's going to be the percentage of pure water. That's 0.05%. Actually, it's 0 0.05 is a decimal, 5%. My apologies. 5% solution. 